A little bit. And there's beef immediately. Here yeah, we go. Right in the face. They've had their problems over the last couple of months. Remember, this all started when Chad Spectacular eliminated Steven Fuertes from that hybrid title number one contenders battle royal back at Hustle Palooza in the month of April. These are the moments where you do respect Papa Giorgio for having to get in between these two very volatile teams. Anderson and Rats have had a couple of battles, you know, one such one being the last rules in a match that will soon come to IWTV and on DVD from our friends at Smart Mark Video. See, relaxed rules is kind of a misnomer because you hear that and you're like, oh, the things are going to kind of be chill. No. No, not at all. Not, not at all. No. Right. You might as well just say no rules. So, Fuerte is spectacular and Stark can tell. And the distraction from Anderson. You know, if you're going to start beefing, you don't want to be in the other person's corner when no. both of them can get to you. So, I think that's that. a bit of an experience. And there's the cockiness from Stephen Fuerte. He has a face only a mother could love. And even his mother's thinking about it. Yeah, she's having questions, yes. For sure. Steven Fortes is one of those people that you would see on a, a, a certain reality show on MTV. And you'd be like, I just want to punch him. Right the uh, let's see. It, love. Well, involves this state. Oh. Even though he's not from this state, it involves this state. Oh. Yeah, he'd be one of those people. I see. You know. GTL, fist pumping. I'm sure he does that in his I spare see. time. Oh, pie face. Oh, there you go, Chad. Just cold cost him with that forearm. That's a little rough. Whoa, what the hell? Oh. What are we doing? Oh, right. slap on the keister. And again. Don't take Chad Lowe, you know, he's very extravagant, shall we say. We heard the Well, Tama drop a little Bob Acklin action. Manhattan drop. Nice drop kick. Yeah. First cover of matchup one, two, only two. And immediately tag in. That's smart. To the heavy hitter of the Marauders, JB Anderson. Here comes Johnny Raditz. Very smart. Big kick there from Raditz. He has sev several backgrounds in combat. Oh, blocking the shot there. Anderson. Ooh, Swing nice blade stop. there. One, two. Slowly but surely, Johnny Raditz is developing you know, more of the catch as catch stand style to his matches. You know, more pro wrestling to his arsenal. That MMA background, the thing about it is that there are people that like to focus completely on it, and then there are people that like to build with it, and I think that is the better strategy, personally. Uh -oh. So Tagore's back in, sweeping out the leg. Look out! Oh, no! A little stink face, <laughs> stink face action there from Chad. Tim Anderson doesn't know where he is. He faces back in Baltimore. He's in a haze. Oh, going oh. for the spin kid, nobody home. Now look out, Chad, look out. Oh. Belly to that suplex. And now JB Anderson's no longer playing around. No more fun, fun and games here. Is that what the, uh, is that what the taking off of the bandana? Yeah, uh, yeah, that means they're serious. Yeah. It's like a power up? Yeah, I see. something like that. Yeah. Now JB. Oh, very nice vertical suplex. That was high. Yeah. That was a very high vertical suplex. Well, yeah, right down, right in the middle of the back. Chad's in trouble. Don't get him out of the ref. That pointed boot right to the throat, up in the chest area. It's this is not relaxed for rules. This is normal rules. So there is a five count. And if the Marauders don't watch themselves, they're going to get disqualified. That's very consistent five count for Papa George. Now tagging Fortes, there's the running elbow. JB, oh, Bulldog. I thought JB was gonna do something, but I spoke too soon. That's good, that deceptive shot. If it, de if it deceived you, imagine what it did to his opponent. Yes, He's indeed, ready yeah. ready for a low shot, he gets hit high, that's tough. 100% factual. Fortes with that Bulldog headlock gets in your fall. 
Where does a guy spend more of his time trying to put away his opponent than worried about bad mouth in the H2O faithful? And just walking across Chad's back, that's, that's where the Marauders have been focused on, is the back of Chad's spectacular. And it's the biggest muscle in your body. It's the easiest way to take down your opponent. They're unable to swing their arms, they're unable to support their legs. Number suplex. Chad Spectacular's back is taking a beating as Fortes gets another good fall. Now Fortes, one thing you should not be doing is arguing with here. Papa Giorgio about any sort of cadence of count. Yes, as, we, as, we've, as we've said. Yes, we, yeah, Very we've talked about. Uh, pulling back on the arm while standing on the back and Yes, it does damage to the arm, but it also still does damage to the back as well. Tissimus dorsi, I believe is the uh, technical term for the for the lats. That helps you move your shoulder. Thank I'm you very for impressed by that. Forte <laughs> <laughs> scoop. Here. And a slam. Tag back into JB. The basics are basics because they work. JB off the ropes. There's that bonk, that bonk headbutt. And again, third one. Only two. It's a series of headbutt shades of shades of Tomaki Homna or the late great Bam Bam Bigelow. Yes. Going for a big elbow strike here. Rolling elbow, no, nobody home. Chad, spectacular view. Got the spectacular view, and there's the tag in the Johnny Riot. And now the Fuertes, here we go. Just, just, just knocks Fuertes down. He's shot downstairs. Whoa, nice high knee there from Raditz. Whoa, Fuertes, wild shot there. Raditz trying to get set. Release German suplex. Work every Cover time. two. JB in to break it up. Starting to break down a little bit, Jack. Absolutely. Here comes Chad. Oh, going for bicycle knee. Oh, headbutt. Right in another bonk. Right underneath the chin. That did damage to JB as you see he falls all the way out to the opposite side of the ring. You think there's some Samoan on the Anderson side of the ring? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. It seems like it. Those headbutts don't seem to be hurting him. Just they a, seem to really just get a, on Just that. a little bit in that bloodline of his, yes. Another one. Another headbutt. Oh, Impaler DD. Impaler DDT there from JB. Johnny Rats might be done. As now the Marauders are calling for a double team. Oh Lord, what are we doing here? Whoa! Shades of the demolition decapitation. One, two, that's it. The Marauders get the win. Was that the thing? <laughs>